hello guys welcome back to good show tips in this video i'm going to teach you how to add emoji and emoji and emoji into your uh, personal contacts in ios 13 like uh, before getting into the start let me give you a brief introduction so we knew that the uh, an emoji and emoji has come to the forward well the introduction of iphone 10 so we were using this in the iMessages for a long period of time but we used to use it in the chat but here how to add these kind of an emoji and emoji in your contact list of your particular person if you wanted to call so how to do this so this is a good uh, like kind of uh, i think it's really funny which you can you'll come to know later on but so in order to do that all you have to do is you have to select the particular person to whom you wanted to add the an emoji or emoji so particular sir for example let me take mine so uh, let me take mine okay sorry let me uh, take mine so this is mine so now uh, i have taken my contacts over here so I just wanted to show my viewers how to do this. So in order to do that, what you have to do is you have to press at the top right, which is edit option here, right? Now you have to press over here. And there is one option at the bottom, which is asking to add photo, right? You have to select this. Right now, while you're selecting this, there is plenty of options where you can add an emojis, right? As you can see, you can add the kind of emojis. For example, let me select uh, any one of these. For example, I have to select it to make a mole cry if I'm taking this. So now they're asking further options. If you wanted kind of any particular uh, position or the post which you wanted to add to the particular contacts, so your fellow friends, your very close friends or your very far friends, you can add respect to that, you can add this. So what you have to do, you have to select which one you need. For example, there are many faces around, uh, I think 12 uh, various of uh, poses are there in which you can select. For in my convenience, I'm taking this. Right, this is how I look like. So now I have to go to next. So continue further. So this is now I can move here and there and then I can make sure or if I wanted to keep like move and scale like how you want it to be. So for example, if I wanted to make it smaller, I can make it by zoom uh, pinching it out. If I wanted to make it larger, I can do this and you can cross this out the same way. So this is how you can add move and scale. Now you have to go for once you're done with the particular uh, size which you wanted to make it. For example, I'll keep in the medium size. It does up to it's not so big. It's not so large. So it's I mean, it's not so small. So once done with it, you have to go to choose options, right? So done with it. Now they're asking further questions like whether you want to make it more changes, like whether you have to select any kind of uh, colors to the uh, particular person, for example, respecting to the skin tone, for example, if my fellow friends, or if in my case, I'm an average colored person, so I'm going for this one. Okay, I'm done with this. It's, now this is how you can do it. If I done, it is okay, fine with it. And even imagine that you wanted more, not, I mean, what I meant is, apart from this, if you wanted more, you can also change this. So in order to do that, you have to press over here in the plus icon, which will be giving more options, right? So as you can see, you can find more options. Like you can change the skin colors as I'm having the various tones over here. You can change over here. Randomly, you can change. And uh, at the same time, you can make it uh, more like, you can adjust it like saturation particular on the page, particular person. You can do this, right? You can change according to a particular person, right? Now you have the many kind of uh, freckles which you can do over here you can select keep on selecting the freckles and you can select it and then we have cheeks option you can select it uh, you can select the cheeks and you can do a lot of things over here you can select the beauty spot and you can keep on scrolling you can select many things you can customize it in the plus option you can customize according to yours according to the particular person of the particular contact who or she whether he or she looks like you can make it up to it now you have to go for let me cancel it. I don't want this one. So discard the changes. So I have kept one which I haven't showed you guys. This is how. Now I, what I have to do is I have to press over here done. Right? It is done. Now I have to go for done options. Okay. That's done. Now what I have to do is imagine that if uh, how I'm going to make it more effective. So as, as I mentioned, but these and emojis and emojis are very much useful when it comes to the eye messages. Right? So I'm going to demonstration over here. You have to press at the top. Now you have to go for any kind of, uh, for example, message. Right? So imagine that I'm texting something. Hey right so what happens is this is being done and now you have to scroll down a little bit you have to stick over here so you can view my things over here so you will be getting some this is really really excited and so much funny that you can talk with your friends everything and an emoji by yourself and even you can keep this for the caller id when you are getting some kind of calls so it, it is already been there in the time but now it has been advanced by the ios 13 you can make it or customize the particular uh, i mean icons to your own particular contacts in the ios 13 so that's all about how to make it or how to enable or how to set any kind of any emojis and emojis in a particular contacts in the ios 13 so you can ask any kind of questions regarding the, in the comment session we our team will try to get back to you don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for the notification this is shahin signing off from get your tips